Hey everyone, it's Sammy. It's a glasses day today. I went to get an eye test earlier on today, so I have to wear my glasses for the rest of the day. Of the day. I figure since we're going to be looking at products today and not really my face, this doesn't matter. I realize there's a little bit of glare coming from the outside window, but you know, you're not going to be looking at my face anyways. Um, I'm going to be filming my blushes clear out and my bronzers clear out today. So this one is going to be the blushes one and the bronzers clear out is going to be coming out next week. Um, as before, in my kind of like clear out videos, I am going to donate part of the makeup to give a makeup a wonderful charity. Um, you might have heard about it. Caroline Hirons talks about it. I'll put links below. So I am going to be donating a lot of my makeup to the charity. It's for women's refugees. Um, so it's an amazing cause, um, in my opinion. And this time, so usually I've had give the charity, um, trash it or keep it. I've added a fourth one because I just came back from Finland and I remember that my mum always, um, she kind of steals every single time. This time she stole a foundation. Every single time she steals something. She goes through my makeup like, mm, what is that? So, oh, and something else, something else I gave her as well. So I've got one that is give to my mom. Um, so if there's any that I think she will specifically enjoy, I'm gonna give them to her. Okay, but let's get started with the blushes clear up. This is in totally no particular woo, <laughs> order, my blushes. So also, as before, these are my personal blushes. They are not my pro kit. I won't be, I clear that out regularly and it's a different kind of thing anyways. So this is the stuff that I use on myself. Obviously, sometimes I like steal some of these to go into the pro kit when I've got a specific kind of job coming up, but mostly this is just my stuff. And let me tell you, this is way too many blushes for one person. I'm gonna get started with a couple of Deborah Milano's, the paprika that I absolutely love and the cacao that I love. I am so keeping those. Then a couple of NYX cream blushes. I am actually getting rid of all of these. Uh, I'm just gonna smell. Smells great, going to charity. Smells fine. I'm just smelling these to make sure they haven't gone off. Fantastic, they are all going to charity. Then I've got an NYX Dusty Rose. Don't really wear it anymore, I used to love it. That is going to go to charity. And let's see, and oh, one more, Deborah Milano Rosa Pesca. I used to wear this tons and tons. Um, actually, I might dig that out again because I haven't worn it recently. Uh, Max Warm Soul, absolutely keeping. I must say that most of my MAC blushes are in palettes and um, I most of the MAC blushes I actually don't even use on myself. I use on my clients, which is a shame, I guess, but that's the way it is. Then I've got a lot of Milani blushes. I've got Dolce Pink, didn't suit me very well, so that is going to charity. Then I've got Luminoso. For some reason, Luminoso doesn't suit me and Luminous does, so I'm going to get rid of that. And Milani Delicioso Pink, absolutely stunning, keeping that. Uh, and then there is a Bellissima Bronze, didn't work on me either, but the uh, Luminous from Milani is so gorgeous. I absolutely love it, so I am keeping that. Couple of Lorac's, keeping both of these. Uh, I've got, what is this? Velvet Rope and Exposed. Love and use both of them. Oh, another NYX Cream Blush, and this is Boho Chic. I am kind of over them for some reason. Bobbi Brown's Pale Pink, one of my all-time favorites. Have a hip pan, so. Uh, that will be gone soon, but not quite yet. Then let's see, I've got a couple of more cream blushes. This is one of my all time favorite MAC blushes. Have a lovely day. This is convertible color. I absolutely love this and I am keeping that. Model and Co's, this is quite new, just peachy. Absolutely love this color. Um, I'm totally keeping that. It is a really good cold winter's day kind of color. 
a couple of Edmue um, blushers. Kind of like them, I just bought them to try them out, but not enough, so I am going to give them to charity. Two blushes that I absolutely can't get rid of. These are the Marilyn Monroe uh, Legendary and the Perfect Cheek uh, from the MAC collection from Marilyn Monroe, love them. Another one that I can't get rid of, Rocketeur. A lot of you might know that one from Benefit. Then let's do a couple of liquids. Uh, this is the Dior Cheek and Lip Glow. Didn't show up on me. My mum is very pale and she does love Dior. So she's getting that. Then the Sonia Kashuk uh, Poppy. Again, didn't really work on me that well. And I'm not the biggest fan of liquid apart from this. So the Danielle Sander Watercolor. And this is a Spicy. I absolutely love this. So um, Clinique, I love this. Berry Pop. I am keeping that. And then this is the Dior, um, Dior Blush Cheek Cream in Bikini. Oh my God, I love this color. So this is the, the only problem is, it sometimes pops out like that, which annoys me so much. Um, but yeah, I love, I love, love, love the color. Then a couple of Chanel ones. Uh, I've got Revelation, which is my favorite Chanel blush probably of all time. Cream blush, I am keeping it. <laughs> there isn't much left. Um, Destiny, which is kind of one of those blushes that is almost a bronzer, but not quite. It's like the equivalent of Nars's Dussur. Um, when you want blush that has no color, love it. And then this is amazing when I've got a tan and I have broken this and I'm so gutted. This is Presage. I often don't wear peaches, but when I do, I love them. So yeah, I've broken it, but I'm gonna keep wearing it anyways. A couple of Laura Mercier's. This one is part of their, I think they don't make these anymore, Amberstone Mineral Cheek Color Powder. Love, love, love this. And then I have a few in a palette. I don't know where the middle one is. The middle one is somewhere, but I have got Rose Petal and Pink Cheek Veil. Love both. One is a cream, one is a, oh my God, I've got so many now on the keep, I feel really bad. And then I've got Oleander. Oleander is one of my all time favorites. It's really delicate. It's very, very similar to, actually, let's just swatch these while we're at it. On my face, it looks really similar to Have a Nice Day. On my hand, uh, Have a Nice Day is definitely movier. Hmm but on my face, they look very, very similar. Anyways, keeping that as well. Then I've got two Bourjois cream blushes. I went gaga for these for a while. I don't really like them that much. I've got a bronzy one and I have got a peachy one. I'm gonna give both of these away. They're no good for my mum. My mum only likes pinky ones. Uh, then I've got Rose Radiance. Speaking of pinkies, but I love this as well by Bare Minerals. So I am keeping that. They're nothing to trash. I'm really disappointed. I've got a Bobbi Brown one called Rose Blush. Absolutely does not work on me at all. That is going away. It has nothing to do with rose whatsoever. And I have a fresh one. I am too, I'm not pale enough for this. This is a gorgeous color called Blossom. I think I'm gonna try this on my mum. And then I've got Essence's Blush Up. This is really cool. I just, I want to keep, this. it makes me happy because of the ombre kind of effect. The ombre thing always for me is a winner. It just looks so pretty. So I am going to keep that. And I'm gonna two absolute keepers that I don't need to think about. Hourglass Mood Exposure. It's a little bit broken. Oh no, I hate that, but I absolutely love it. And obviously a Tom Ford. This is the only Tom Ford blush I have um, and I love, but I never invested in more. Um, this is the Wicked one. Is it Wicked? Yeah, love it. I do know there's a couple of other ones that I want, but I gotta clear out these other blushes first to make some room. Then I've got a bunch of NARS blushes. Um, I am going to keep all of them. I love NARS blushes. I've got Exhibit A, Orgasm, De Sur, Unlawful, Deep Throat, and Torrid. It's pointless trying to swatch all of these. I've got Gaiety somewhere as well, but for some reason it's not here. A couple more, uh, Maquillage's Blush uh, so in Soft Pink. I think this one will suit my mum as well. It's pink and she's quite pale. This is a delicate blush, so I will be sending that to her. And then Topshop's Afternoon Tea. This is pretty intense color. It is gorgeous, but I rarely wear it, so I'm going to give that away. 
and then Natio, love Natio as a brand. This is actually a bronzer slash blusher, uh, great holiday type staple. It's a great combination of blushes and bronzers. So I think I'm going to keep this one. And then I just have a bunch of Ilamasca. So um, I've got a bunch of the cream ones, which I all love. I've got Laid, Keeping, Rude, Absolutely Keeping, it's incredible, Seduce, Totally Keeping, and Zygomatic, this is amazing for contouring. Um, very slight contouring. Then I've got three velvet ones uh, that I'm all giving away. So Sleek, uh, Conviction, I don't like the velvet uh, consistency, and Peaked. Great colors, but I just don't like the consistency. And then I've got six uh, Ilamasca. I love Ilamasca powder blushes. They are just amazing. Shall I go through? Oh no, I, I have zero to trash. This is really shocking. Um, Chaste, beautiful color. Hussy, oh my God, I love this. Katie, actually, Katie, I'm gonna give it to my mom. It is so, 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 so pale. It doesn't really show up on me. Uh, Naked Rose, gorgeous color. Disobey, I use this song for contouring myself all the time. And then um, Powder Blush and Ambitions. This is the only one I don't like, and it's because it has shimmer on it. So this one actually won't go. So I'll show you pics here of what I'm giving to my mom. <laughs> Charity, trashing, keeping, all of that good stuff. So I'm gonna give 19 to Charity, trashing absolutely zero, giving four to my mom, and keeping a whole lot. But it is now all colors that I love. So I think, I think that's a good thing. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching and do check out the charity um, as well in case you have makeup that you want to get rid of. And next week it'll be bronzers. So thanks for watching, bye.